I'm Michael Denegris from Autonomic Controls, and uh, this year at CD, our, our flagship presentation is our uh, Mirage Media Server. Uh, the Mirage Media Server is a five soft source uh, digital music server uh, that is also cloud enabled. Um, a very special feature about the server is that it, it um, not only is capable of storing content locally, but also synchronizes all that content with a secure digital locker on the internet, which uh, gives you three really unique benefits. One, um, you have a secure backup of all of your content off-site, which is really important. It's great to back up your content, but when it's off-site, it's, it's uh, more uh, secure from physical problems at the, uh, at, the, at the residence where you have your content. Number two, it gives you remote access to your media. So using your iPhone or your iPad or Android devices, when you're away from home and, and don't have access, direct access to your media server, you can actually log into that secure account on the internet and listen to all your content without having to have had the forethought to uh, pre-sync your iPhone or your iPad. It's just there, so you have your entire collection with you at all times. Um, and third, if you have multiple locations, so a couple of houses or um, a vacation home or your office, you can put a second Mirage Media Server there and connect it to the same cloud-based account. And what that does is facilitates automatic synchronization between the two servers. Um, what we have here is our iPad application, uh, and the iPad application is capable of doing all of the things that you would expect uh, with your media server. You can browse um, by all of the standard pivots. We have uh, artist, album, genre, uh, and composer, the things that you would expect from a music server. Uh, in addition to that, uh, we also have uh, access to online radio services, um, such as Pandora Radio and Radio Time. Um, Pandora is a great service that allows you to um, actually uh, listen to content uh, and have it suggest content for you based on uh, music that you really like. So using the Mirage Media Server here, um, I can come in here and enter the name of an artist or a song like Diana Krall, for instance. I'll say OK there. And it's going to go out and interact with my Pandora radio account. It's going to search for Diana Crawl. It's going to come back here and say, just ask for some clarification. Is this an artist or is it a song? Um, Diana, as we know, is an artist. And so now it gives me a number of choices. This is the artist I was looking for right up here on top. And now it'll go out and actually create a new Pandora radio station for me on my server and on my internet based Pandora account. So it's all. Um, synchronized. Uh, so it creates that radio station and then it goes out and actually tunes it and it will uh, start playing back uh, the content. Another neat feature that we pro provide access to here is um, radio time in a radio. So if I go here to radio, Radio here, and I'll select Radio Time. Radio Time is a uh, aggregation service that actually allows you to um, uh, aggregate all of the internet-based radio stations around the world into a database that you can search by location, genre, um, program type, or whatnot. So you see here in the corner we have our Diana Crawl radio um, playing. But if I want to uh, browse music radio stations around the world, I can browse my Radio Time uh, library here, and I'll scroll down through all of the different categories that I have. We'll go into top 40 pop radio around the world. Um, and now I can uh, have a couple of other pivots. It knows what my location is. So if I want to see what my local top 40 radio stations are, um, I have two to select from. It knows I'm in Atlanta, Georgia today. Um, and it knows that by the IP address. So it, it, it figures out your location based on the uh, server that you're, that you're connected to. Uh, and now I'm listening to Radio Time uh, uh, top 40 pop station here in Atlanta with more metadata and all of those things. Um, and these services interact with each other. So if I click on the actions button here and I, I like what I hear on the radio, so I'm listening to a radio station, a really great song comes up, I can say, hey, I like this song. Create a Pandora radio station from this song. And I click on it and it's going to use the metadata provided by the, um, by the application. If you find something in the Pandora radio station, uh, database, it'll actually go ahead and create that station for me. And that works with local content or Sirius XM radio or any of the online so sources that we offer. And that is the Mirage Media Server.